Hey everyone, before we begin this video, I just want to take a second to thank every single one of you for subscribing to the channel. We just hit 2,000 subscribers last week. And of course, with every 1,000 subscribers, we do a giveaway. So there will be a giveaway coming up very, very soon. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. That way you don't miss out on that information. Thank you so much for subscribing and supporting the channel. All right, let's begin with the video now. Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back. So it is one in the morning, Friday. Well, I guess technically Saturday now. Um, and this weekend is the Premier League US Summer Tour and someone on Instagram just told me that they found the hotel where the Aston Villa players are staying at and so I'm thinking what if I were to show up there and get my uh, Emmy Martinez jersey signed that would be really cool which is something that I already had in mind when going to these games because I was looking forward to maybe the, the really a slightest off chance of getting to meet um, Emmy Martinez and Enzo Fernandez and get my jersey signed um, but now that uh, I know where the hotel is, I'm thinking maybe I can go there early in the morning and see if I can somehow get the signature by just hanging out by the lobby or something. I don't know. So that's going to be my plan for now. So I'm going to wake up in about four or five hours and then just go to DC and see if I can make that happen. So I already have my jersey. It's all packed up. Um, and yeah, we're going to see how this goes. So. It's gonna be a fun little weekend. We're gonna go ahead and try to get a signature, and then the next day it's gonna be the big game. So, looking forward to this one. So yeah, I will see you in the morning, and let's hope for the best. All right, so I'm in DC, and I got here just in time. As soon as I got here, I saw the Vesson Villa players coming out of their hotel, and I was able to meet Emmy Martinez, El Libu, and he signed my jersey. So. That was pretty unreal right there. Uh, I'm still here hanging out and I'm probably gonna wait for them to come back from their training because I want him to sign my Argentina jersey also, the one that says Campeones del Mundo. So we'll see, hopefully it works out. Here with the boys in DC. It is really hot though. Okay, so trying to unpack everything that happened. So I woke up at six in the morning, went all, I drove to DC. I got there at 8.35 and I saw like Villa staff members coming out of the hotel. So I was like, oh my God, they are actually here. I parked my car as quickly as I could. And then as soon as I, you know, got back to like the main lobby, they were starting to come out. There were two other people there with me. Uh, they were also trying to get uh, Divo's um, signature or get, you know, sign the jersey, whatever. Um, and yeah, it was cool. He came out and he signed my jersey. He signed some pictures for the other two people that were waiting with us. And everything happened so fast. I didn't even get a chance to like take a picture or get a video of him doing it. And you know, that's kind of stuff that maybe you do want to have recorded that way it proves its authenticity. But I just, I, I, it's like I froze. Like I didn't even know what to say to him. Like I was just, you know, the only thing I did get to say to him was thank you for winning the World Cup for Argentina. And I got to say that to him, so I'm happy that I was able to say that. But everything else, I kind of just froze. I wanted him to sign my Argentina jersey, but like I said, everything happened so fast that I just, I, I didn't even have time to pull that out. And yeah, and that was that. And then, so once uh, everyone got on the bus to go to training, me and the other two guys decided, well, shoot, maybe we should just wait till they come back and then we can try again to get the other stuff that we didn't get signed. So I was told that the Villa players were there by another uh, content creator called Debatable Football Opinions. He was the one who was able to tell me where they were. Shortly after I got Debo's signature, uh, he and his crew was able to meet up with us afterwards and then we all kind of just hung out and just waited for them to come back um, They did come back. That one was a little bit less successful with trying to get stuff signed They got to get their stuff signed I was kind of trying to look for a Coutinho because my friend Bobby really wanted his jersey signed and I had his jersey with me Well, I bought him that jersey. It's a Villa jersey and, and you know, I bought him with a Coutinho on the back and I wanted to get it signed for him but 
I was again kind of caught up with Divu and trying to look for Coutinho and I just also wanted Divu to sign my Argentina jersey but I also had Coutinho's jersey and I had my Sharpie in my hand and everything just became such a mess. I ended up not getting anything signed and ended up marking his Bobby's uh, uh, Coutinho jersey pretty bad. Like it's not the worst thing in the world but I definitely messed up and so yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so I hope he's not mad at me for that. But you know, again, we're gonna still try tomorrow when we go to the to the actual game and see if we can, you know, get that signature from Coutinho, and hopefully he can sign over where I made that mark, so he it'll cover up a little bit. And yeah, so that's pretty much the wrap of this day. Um, and then we just got tomorrow to look forward to, which is the actual game and some other events. So I'm about to go pick up some food and then head over to Bobby's house. So yeah. That's that. A few moments later. Imagine being out there in this kind of weather. Nope. I, I f***ed up. I messed up. We don't say bad words here. This is my jersey. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. I had good intentions. I was trying to sign it for you. Hopefully that you wouldn't. No. <laughs> you said it was little. It, that's little. How's Coutinho gonna... He's got, he has to sign... He's gonna have to sign that big. Look, he's, he can sign he can right sign here, here. And then he can do his initials. There you go. Damn. <laughs> hey, man. It's called art. It is. It's your signature. This is the new... Yeah. This is the first... That's a dysentery FC mark. <laughs> Yeah. I tried. There's the intention of the counts here. <laughs> okay, so here's the plan for tomorrow. So we're gonna plan to get there at around maybe like 8.45 a.m. The gates to the Premier League Fan Fest opens at 9 a.m. I don't know what kind of events they'll have there, but I figured it'd be kind of cool to show up and see what they got. Um, and yeah, we're gonna be wearing our Aston Villa jerseys. And the reason why we're gonna be wearing those is because I bought tickets in the Aston Villa supporter section with the idea that I can maybe try to get Emmy Martinez to sign my jersey. Now, obviously that already has happened. So I don't necessarily need to sit there anymore, but I mean, I already bought the tickets, so what can I do? But also I just don't wanna be disrespectful wearing like a city jersey at an Aston Villa supporter section and be rude like that, you know? So we got these jerseys just for that reason so we can be respectful to all the other Villa uh, supporters around us and yeah that's that's really that honestly nothing more to it so yeah we're gonna be Aston Villa posers during the game but you know I did it for Emmy Martinez I am gonna be supporting him so there's that I could have worn Argentina jersey I could maybe still wear an Argentina jersey but yeah no I'll just wear the Villa jersey I'll be respectful but yeah anyway two Villa posers coming your way See you in the morning. <laughs> <laughs>
All right, everyone, that was pretty much the whole day. Uh, it was a very eventful weekend. It was really hot. I feel like I, well, you can probably see I got a little bit of sunburn right there. But yeah, it was a very hot day. It was a fun day, hot day. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna drive home now and then uh, we will recap the entire weekend and show you the stuff that I got while I was here too. So I got some pretty cool things. So uh, we'll catch you once I get home, which will be a very long drive. So I'll see you in a bit. <sighs> All right, well, that's pretty much that. It was a very successful weekend. The main goal when I purchased these tickets was to get Emmy Martinez or Elibu to sign my jersey and I made it happen. Not the way that I thought was gonna happen, but this ended up being a much better way for it to happen. So I'm glad that it all worked out in the end. And here it is right here. And I'll do an overlay that way you can see a little bit better the signature and stuff like that. But really awesome that this actually happened. So I'm really stoked about that. With Emmy being a World Cup winner from Argentina, obviously I'm part Argentinian so this means a lot to me so it's really 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 awesome to now have this in my collection so awesome awesome but then on the actual day of the game I was able to pick up some pretty cool things like I did get this Premier League Landover Maryland jersey right over here and on the back it just has Premier League 23 it's a really cool jersey it's not like any kind of brand like Nike Adidas or anything like that it's just Premier League but it's still pretty cool nice little novelty thing to have and then some of the smaller things I got this little Premier League US Summer Series hat that this dude just gave us it's not like a super high quality hat or anything like that but I'll take I'll take freebies all day long. Then we got these nice little Brentford koozies over here. Um, they're double-sided. One has the Brentford badge on it, the other one says Go Beast. Pretty cool. Then I also got this little Chelsea US Tour little bandana scarf thingy. Um, it's Chelsea, so don't really care much for it, but it's still, you know, a cool little freebie. I like free stuff. And then we got some oversized Panini cards for Sterling, Ramsey, and Robinson over here. Uh, they didn't have any of the Brentford players for one of the cards, so I don't, I don't know what happened there, but they got three of the teams, three of the players that were playing that day. And then probably my second favorite item is uh, my little FC24, <laughs> a little cover poster right there. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it was pretty cool. Yeah, the whole experience was pretty good. I definitely had a really good time. Obviously, my time watching the games does not compare to me meeting Emmy Martinez and getting my jersey signed, but overall as a weekend, it was a really good experience. I was expecting a little more in the Fan Fest, but I also can't complain. But yeah, that pretty much wraps up this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to leave a thumbs up down below if you did. I wanna thank you again for the 2,000 subscribers and we will be doing a giveaway very, very soon. I'm just waiting for the final details. I might get some collaborators to join in this giveaway. So I'm just waiting on those final details. So make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're not already. That way you don't miss out on those details. I'll be making a separate video announcing what the giveaway is gonna be. So subscribe so you don't miss out on it. All right, everyone, well, I hope you have a great day, week, month, year, and I'll catch you in the next video. Take care.